Hi, I'm Charlie Arturola for AS Wine Imports here in British Columbia. And when I say Tempranillo, I just go back 30 years ago when I start drinking Tempranillo. And I have to say, when I have to drink Tempranillo, I got to always wait for that bite back. Because that is also something that recognizes this incredible grape that changes faces as it goes through Spain. As you know, this is the most planted red grape in Spain. This is one of the, the, the most, I, I would say, uh, elegant grapes if you know how to treat it. Now, we are talking about a wine from Rivera del Duero. We're talking about a wine that is from uh, Pina Fidelis, which is uh, a, a very powerful group of um, wine investors that about 15 years ago, they just came to Peña Fiel. Peña Fiel is a, a little um, commune around the castle of Peña Fiel in Rivera del Duero, right on the heart of the Duero. You probably know the Douro, which is a river. In Spain, we call it the Duero. And uh, when I talk about uh, Tempranillo, made in Rivera del Duero, I'm talking about one of the most, I would say, respected uh, denomination of origins in Spain. As you probably know, uh, Rivera del Duero is the house of many, many powerful houses and where, for many, the best expression comes from that little secret that many, many people don't know. This is a wine that is made with American oak. And when we talk about American oak, we need to remember this is the best marriage that we ever or we will ever encounter in the business of wine. Uh, Tinta del País, how Tempranillo is known in this part of the, the Spain, uh, from Peña Fiel, has four months in American oak. So that gives the, the wine a little bit of uh, more body, more cuerpo, as we say in Spanish, uh, a different structure, much more structure than any other uh, types of wines that we, we taste from other parts of Spain. And this is what I call a challenging red. A challenging red for the person who really likes to have maybe lamb chops or maybe a stew or maybe a nice tuna fish with the spices and, and, and tomato and capers. And when I talk about that cherry elegance, that character and personality, very few wines from uh, Rivera del Duero can have at this price point because Bodegas Pina Fidelis is one of the biggest players in Peña Fiel, in Rivera del Duero, and the name of the wine is Condominio Roble. Remember, this is one of the styles that they are very, very in fashion to drink today because they're easy drinking, didn't spend much time in the oak, uh, only about a year before being released, and I have to say, drink Condominio Roble and you will probably get the expression of a great Tempranillo grape in your mouth. Very cherry, cherry explosion. Salud!